How to select programs in Spooky2 software? Spooky2 has the world's largest frequency database in the world. Many users may have questions about how to search and select programs in Spooky2 software. Don't worry, I will tell you in this video. First, you need to choose suitable keywords when searching in Spooky2 software. If you don't know how, please check the video in our description. Second, choose the program according to the program descriptions. For example, you want to find programs for retinopathy. There are diabetic retinopathy and retinopathy of prematurity in the searching results. According to the description, the program diabetic retinopathy is for retinal damage due to diabetes, which can cause blindness. And the program retinopathy of prematurity is used for eye disease of premature babies, generally due to intensive oxygen therapy. You can choose the program according to your condition. Third, take the author into consideration. If programs have an identical program name, but author and frequencies are different, you could first try the program written by an author considered more reliable. For example, PROV, CAFL, ETDFL, XTRA, than cache Z. If programs are different, but have one or more identical frequencies, you might decide to choose the one that offers more possibilities. For example, program Acne 1 includes some frequencies in Acne 2. So Acne 1 is preferred. Fourth, Program total runtime may also be an important factor. When set up a preset with multiple programs, please do not exceed a total running time of more than four hours for remote mode or plasma mode. You could see the total runtime for all programs you select here. Thanks for watching this video. What would you consider when choosing a program? Welcome to share your experience with us.